We got a dying guy in here. We got another dying guy. Oh no. Murphy, no, you were so young. We just hired you two missions ago. Oh, we can land this. We can land this quick. Maybe Murphy will survive. Hey, hey, how's it going guys? Spy here and welcome back to another Bomber Crew episode. And last episode, we kind of failed. Our plane crashed into the ground. Our whole crew died, but look at that. We have a brand new bomber plane here. It looks almost the same. We just got to add some stuff to it. We're going to go over to the starboard outer engine here. Add the MK2. We're going to go to the gun turrets. Add a 303 times 2 MK2 on the back there. So we have a little bit more firepower to destroy our enemies. And I added some lightweight armor so that we could get out of the battle faster. I don't know if that's a good idea or not, but we're going to try it. Okay, so we're going to go over to the briefing room. We're going to test out some missions here. Now, I did one mission in between this episode and last episode. It was a really simple one, but we got this perk here, which puts the enemy damage down for the next two missions. Now, they all give us the same amount of money. And I think I want to take out this tank factory first thing so that it helps our ground troops. And bam, there's our plane. Now, they updated the game quite a bit. If you check out right here, we can automatically refill our gunner's ammo just by pressing R. It's so much more simple than having to click on them, make them go over there, grab the ammo, and then click back on their position. Um, it's harder to micromanage in that sense, but now that we can do that, it's so much more easy. So here we go, we're gonna take off, we're gonna head over there, make sure to raise our landing gear so there's less air resistance on our plane, uses less fuel, and we get a faster speed going. All right, here we go. Go up, raise gear. Head over there. Now, I would go to a medium or high altitude usually, but the problem with that is you use more fuel and my navigation people can't see. Once we have our plane a little more upgraded, we could probably do higher missions. There is going to be a lot of flak turrets and cannons everywhere, so we're going to have a little trouble with that. And I think if we stay at a lower altitude, it will be a little better for us. But the only problem with that is the enemy aircraft will be able to reach us. Oh, what? Something already broke? What the heck? Go repair that. That sucks. That really sucks. It's a hydraulic system for the doors. We need that. We need that to bomb that facility. All right. Enemy fighter spotted on radar. Where at? Where at? Where at? Um, over there. Over there. So target them really fast. Fire. Shoot them before they get us. Go over there. And we're good. All right, guys. Open fire. Open fire. Get them out of here before they reach us. I don't know if that's possible. We do have that back cannon there, which is nice. Oh, one down. Almost two down. And come on, three down. Th three down. Oh, no. They damaged our engine already. No way. That's not fair, is it? Okay. Grab the fire extinguisher really slowly. Can't run. Got to go up there. We got to target that position. There is flak cannons. I could see them shooting already. Go and put that fire out, dude. Go and put that fire out. Spray it. There we go. Okay. Get back inside. Get into your position so we have some statistics on our fuel and stuff like that. Where do we go from here? Where do we go from here? Not too sure. Um, over there. Then we got some fighters coming towards us. Shoot them. Okay, Flack is pretty close to us. Got to go over there. One down, two down. Get that last guy. Come on. Okay, there it is. That's where we have to go to bomb the tank factory. All right, so we're pretty close already, but I'm going to leave my guy in that position. We can easily get him to go down there if we need him to. Uh, it looks like we're going to okay, get into that position there. Open doors, select those. And we're going to bomb this really fast. Is there any turrets there? I don't see any flat cannons anywhere. So I think we're in the clear now. There's some way over there though. So we got to keep clear of that. All right. Here we go. Bomb this really quick. And get back home. Oh, we got some, we got some enemy fighters in the air. Bam. Drop them. Okay. Good. Target those planes. Close the doors. Get in there. And we're going to get back home. We're going to get back home really fast. Target every single enemy plane here. We're going to do our best to get out of here. Okay, dude. Get on the bottom turret. Get on the bottom turret. We don't need you anywhere else at the moment, but in a gunner position to help fight. There you go. Nice. Start shooting them. Start shooting them, everyone. Got to get them out of here. 
There is about six of them on our tail. That guy's out of ammo. Go get more ammo, dude. This is so much easier being able to just click the R button to resupply our gunners. It takes a lot less micromanagement to be able to resupply. Oh, man. Are they retreating? Nope. We got more fighters. More fighters in front of us. Oh, no. Target them. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. Uh, I don't know if we're going to need that at the moment. But we'll get him to repair it anyways. I think the other planes are retreating except those guys on that tail there. They're still on our tail. I don't know why they aren't getting destroyed. Uh, this guy has no ammo. Resupply, everyone. Everyone resupply. There we go. Oh, we got to snap a picture right there. Okay, that's good. That's good. Go down there. We're going to snap a photo and get out of here. And take photo. Perfect. Now let's get back home. <laughs> We're in enemy territory right now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Got to put that fire out. We got to put that fire out. Put that fire out, dude. Oh, no. Revive him. Go revive that guy. We might have someone dying in this mission. Hopefully not. Uh-oh. Oh, there goes our engine. There goes one of our engines. It just popped off. It just popped off. But that's okay. I think we're in the clear now. I think we're almost in the clear. Dude, you got to get more ammo. Got to get more ammo. Get in the top gun here. You get in the bottom gun and start firing. Fix our hydraulic system so we can land over there. Man, this mission was insane. But I think we got out of it in the clear. Um, lower landing gear. Sweet. Sweet. And we're coming in for a landing. The mission was successful. Uh, we lost one engine. No one died, which is a bonus. And we managed to bomb that facility. We're almost out of field too. That's a close call. Close call. All right. And bam, we landed it. Perfect landing, I think. I don't I, I don't know. That was a little that was a little rough. Perfect. And we get a little more XP so our people aren't as inexperienced for flying and gunning and stuff like that. Everyone's level two, almost level three. Hopefully they don't die soon. That's a bad thing to say, but I want them to level up a bit instead of having to rehire a bunch of crew. Oh, wow. Look at all those upgrades. So we're, we're going to get this 303 times two MK2 up top to help fight a bit. We can get ammo fed guns on the back, which might be pretty helpful. Uh, we don't have to go to the box to refuel. You know what? I kind of want that. But before we do that, let's go to the nose, uh, the, the fuselage, and see how much... Oh, armored fuselage costs a lot. Oh, man. That's cool. But it adds a lot of weight to our plane compared to what we have now, which is the lightweight here. Yeah, look at that. Extra 85 pounds per upgrade. So we're going to go back to the gun turret here. We're going to get ammo fed, and we have $400 to spend... Not much at all. Okay, let's see what we could get at the crew gear. I'm going to give these guys some helmets. Maybe the flak helmet MK1. So that they don't get their noggins hurt. Okay, let's head over to briefing now. We're going to see what missions we have. Uh, we have the search and rescue, which seems pretty nice. But it doesn't pay out as much as these other ones here. Uh, the coupole construction. Ah. I think I'm going to do the Doodlebug Blitz because we have to destroy V1 rocket sites. Don't let these rockets through. Okay, here we go. Let's get this plane off the ground. And over there, I'm just going to speed it up a little bit. And we got to make sure that we raise the landing gear. Like always, sometimes I forget. Fly over there. Raise landing gear. Perfect. I'm good to go now. I think it's a straight down this way and then we'll come up to the rocket sites. Now, I think there's multiple rocket sites, so we're going to have to use one bomb per rocket site because that would suck if I ran out. Um, all right. Oh, we're already close. We can't speed time up anymore. Fly over there. Oh, oh, maybe not. Right there. It's way over there. There's going to be enemies coming towards us soon, but we're just going to stick to our gunners. There's ammo feed on this gun is going to be super helpful. We won't have to reload him. Just the other two gunners, three, maybe we forget someone on that bottom one. But overall, I think it's going to be awesome. Imagine if we got ammo feed on all of these guns. Jeez, that would be amazing. I don't think that, that that's even possible, but we'll see. Oh no, I didn't even realize. Uh, dude, get into the get into your other position right there. Select open doors. 
Okay, we're good, we're good. Luckily, I can slow down time. And... Bam. Head over there, really fast. Got it. Get those enemies off of us. Where are they? Right over there. 19 seconds to get over there for bo before it launches. I think we can do that. Shoot them, guys. Shoot them. The anti-air is not even going for us. Uh, select our other bomb. We could get there. Eight seconds. Seven. Six. You know what? I don't know. We might need better engines to be able to reach these faster. But, okay, here we go. Drop it. No, I think it launched. That's okay. We were really close. I seen the plane take off on the ground there. Target that. Select our bomb. We're getting shot at. We're getting shot at a lot. There is a lot of enemies on our tail. A lot of enemies on our tail. Okay, that guy is going to need some ammo. There's the base. I don't want to click off of it because I might misclick. Drop the bomb. Okay, head over there. Get some ammo for this guy. Ammo. We got more fighters coming towards us. Target them. Oh, there's a picture over there. I don't know if we're going to be able to reach that picture in time. We'll try, though. Drop it. All right. Head. Oh, oh okay. We'll go over there first because we got 26 seconds. Close the doors. Select bomb. And here we go. The last launch site. And we're going to drop our bombs. Go get that picture. Did it already launch? I don't know. Not sure. Okay, go get that picture over there. Perfect. Gun achievement. Close the doors. Get this picture really quick. And... Bam. Alright, let's get back home. Really fast. Oh man, this is too intense. I, I, I'm missing up my words sometimes because there's too many fighting things going on. There's too much fighting going on. Uh oh, our, our uh, engine's on fire. Engine on fire. I don't have the fire extinguisher on that one. Dude, run faster. Let's go put that engine out. Go put that engine out. We got a dead guy in here. We got a dying guy in here. We got another dying guy. Oh, no. That's not good, is it? We got it. Uh, we can't get our gunner off this position. So we got to get our radio guy off. Revive them, radio guy. Revive them. Don't die. I think we're almost in the clear. Hurry, revive. I don't have any more med packs, do I? No, I don't. I think Murphy might die. I think Murphy might die. We can't revive him. We can't revive Murphy. <laughs> That's not good. Murphy, no, you were so young. We just hired you two missions ago. Oh, we can land this. We can land this quick. Maybe Murphy will survive. Maybe he will survive. 30 seconds to land this. Uh, lower the landing gear. We got 17 seconds. Murphy's gonna die. <laughs> oh no, this isn't good. This isn't good. Just go in for a landing. Just go in for a landing over there. What is wrong with the pilot? I don't know. He's going crazy. It's his fault that Murphy died. <laughs> Murphy, no. Blah. He's dead. <laughs> Rest in peace, Murphy. Rest in peace. Well, we made it back home with only Murphy dying. He did his best, guys. Murphy did his best. <laughs> oh, man. That was crazy. Mission result. Pretty successful, I'd say so myself. 3,000 pounds. 4,000 pounds with one dead crew member. He did his best. We will remember him. Continue. <laughs> Poor Murphy. Killed in action. Awesome. Everyone leveled up but Murphy. Good job, Murphy. Oh, wow. Everyone's like level four, almost five now. We get all of these new skills. Mid-alt photo. Recon photos can be taken from mid-altitude. Custom heading. Oh, that's, that's a lot of uh, responsibility right there. All right. So we got to recruit a new engineer, dude, because Murphy died. That's okay. We'll find someone else. Look at these young lads they don't even know what they're getting themselves into chimney sweep okay or roofer and we got an architect would an architect be really helpful in this scenario probably not uh we got a roofer here uh, i think she's probably the most qualified she is already level two as well so let's hire her let's head over to the aircraft here see what else we can add to it uh, we got some livery we got some systems hydraulics Oh, maybe a better hydraulic system would be better because it does blow up easily. Uh, more reliable. Let's do that. Uh, fuselage. We can do the armored fuselage for the front. We could get a better nose turret. That might be helpful. Bam. I'm going to add the armored fuselage on the front there so we have better armor. 
And now that's all we could really do. The plane is as upgraded as we could get it. So let's go in here and see what we could do for a mission. Oh, no. We got enemy ace pilot in area. He's not at this one yet. This is the battery ammo dump. Okay. Okay. So we're going to do this one. I don't want to go fight an ace pilot yet. So we're going to do this one and get out of there fast. This one, oh, oh, a boost. Enemy damage down for the next two missions. That's always helpful. Let's do it. Let's take off. Head that way. We can make our own headings now, which is sweet. But we don't really need to at the moment. Speed this up. Get our landing gear up as well. Bam. Oh, that's pretty neat. Okay, so I'm going to head over here. And then we're going to go in over that way. Huh. Oh, wait. We got to go right there anyways. So we'll go over there. Uh, drop some bombs. Is there a few of them? There's two ammo dumps. Okay, that's good to know. We'll get our guy in his position right now. Select two of the bombs out of five. We'll drop them as fast as possible and get out of there. Oh, we got some pilots up above us. Target them really quick just to get them out of the way. Good, good. Open up the doors quick. I forgot to do that. Open them up. We're good. They're open. And we're going to drop the bombs. Here we go. And drop. Head over there. And release the bombs. Head over there to get a picture. Got them targeted. Got to get those guys back there targeted. And here comes the picture. Oh, there's two pictures. What? That's crazy. I think we could do it. I think we could do it. This will give us a recon bonus. And first picture has been taken. Let's get over there. Photo is ready. Oh, we're getting shot really bad. We're getting shot really bad. Okay. And picture. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Oh, that is a big path of problems. Big path of problems. We got to reload our ammo for this guy up here. Now we just got to get out of here safely. I don't know if that's possible with this many gunners on us. Let's get up. Get up. High altitude. High altitude. Got to go that way. Oh, there's our landing. All right, here we go. Coming in for a landing. Perfect landing, guys. Perfect landing. That is three missions done. Only one crew member has died from it. And kablamo. Doing good. I think the plane is becoming a little more stronger as we go. We almost have 3,000 XP. Come on. Almost 3,000. Once we hit 3,000, we get a bunch of better stuff. Look at all that money we got, though. That's awesome. Everyone gets a bunch of XP. Our crew is becoming grown up, guys. Our crew is growing up. Level 5s and a level 3 engineer. Let's install fire extinguishers on our engines. That's MK2. So now all of them have extinguishers so we can put them out. I uh, didn't have them on this plane because the other one did. And then it got de-equipped once this plane was reconstructed. But now we got all this new li li livery, livery, whatever you want to call it. Uh, pretty sweet. We don't really need all this stuff. We have $2,000, so we could probably get a new electrical system in there. Oh, wait. Installing item would put your bomber over... Okay, I guess we gotta upgrade our engines. Bam. And bam. We now have all standard engine MK2s, and we don't have enough for our, our system anymore, because it's 1,250. Basic armored set. Bam. Looks cool. We'll get our other gunner with that suit on. And sweet. Look at that crew, guys. Look at that crew. Aren't they nice looking? Sweet. I might change the color of our crew depending on their jobs. So, like, the gunners and the bomber will be yellow. And the rest of the guys will be in other suits. So that we can differentiate them a little better if they're out of their positions. But anyways, guys, that is pretty much it for this episode. If you would like to see more bomber crew, let me know in the comments. I'm still learning this game. I'm not the best at it. But if you guys would like to see more, like I said, let me know in the comments. And if you did enjoy, make sure to like and subscribe. And thank you guys for watching and subscribing. And remember, stay sweet. Bye.